introduce some people. We need to talk to you a little bit. Yo, please make some noise. Michael Murray and the man of Mark, Mark Man 23, let's go. What's up, everybody? I'm so happy to be back here. It's been so long since we've been able to gather as fighting game fans, as Tekken fans. Mr. Michael Murray, you want to say hi to the crowd? Hey, everyone. Hope you're enjoying the matches. I know I am. All right, Steve. <laughs> We got to catch up. It's been a long time since we've done this. How are you feeling, my friend? I've been feeling good, man. I've been watching a lot of online Tekken. ICFC has been keeping me happy. I've been watching all these other regions hold us down. Shout outs to every online event that's happened for Tekken 7, because I'm telling you, I've been watching it. It's been beautiful. And I've, I've, I've missed. I've missed you, Mark, man. I've missed you. I missed Michael you, my Murray, friend. Man. But we, we've been good, though. You guys have been all right? We got something to talk about today, Steve. Talk you know, to me. Talk to it's me. been a long time again, everybody. Hopefully, you guys have been doing doing well during this pandemic. Steve, I think we should just tell them. Yeah. Yeah. What's coming back, Steve? Uh, you, do you guys want to know what's coming back? TWT is back, ladies and gentlemen. We're back. Uh, and offline, TWT, we live. It's not the Tekken Online Challenge, it's the Tekken World Tour. The Tekken We're coming World back Tour. June the 24th, but it's not only going to be offline, it's going to be online as well. So I hope you guys are looking yes, forward to that. Yes, Still incorporating the online community with the Tekken World Tour is actually fabulous. It gives all these new players a chance to come out, play online and offline, and still be in the Tekken World Tour. And again, it's been thanks to you guys that you guys have been keeping the hype throughout the pandemic, showing up for all these crazy online Yo, can events. can you guys make some noise for yourselves? Y'all been making Tekken hype. Y'all been making Tekken hype. I love it. I can't wait to see more of it. And as you can see right here, we have our regional qualifier. We have the regional finals. And of course, the Tekken World Tour finals, which was last held in Bangkok, Thailand. Y'all know we went to Amsterdam before that and even San Francisco. And I don't know where we're going next time. Where are we going, Steve? You know, Michael, do you know? Do you know? I can't say everything today. That's something to look forward to at a later date. Sorry. Oh. But again, Tekken World Tour is back. We have the dojo events. We have our master events. And of course, we have our global final that's going to be happening later this year. And again, it starts June 24th. I hope you guys are looking forward to it. June 24th is when we get things started. What, what, but what is, what is June 24th? If we have a day for TWT. What does that mean? Where is that at? I don't know. Let's look at some of the events that we're going to be featuring. Let's look at the regions first, actually. So we are adding two new regions. During the Tekken Online Challenge, we added West Africa, we added South Africa, but this time brand new for Tekken World Tour, we have North Africa and we're separating Pakistan from South Asia, so they have their own region to compete. More Tekken for everybody involved, and that's great because you're going to want these Tekken World Tour points. Obviously, we need to make sure these guys sign up as well. Uh, we, we need to revamp that Tekken World Tour portal. Make sure you guys get signed up for that ASAP if you want to get those points. We're going to be talking about that a lot as well. This is going to be a, quite the season for the Tekken World Tour, I must say myself. Oh, yeah, the season is starting a little bit later than usual, but I hope you guys show up to all of the events. And again, speaking of the events, Let's look at some of the events that are going to be happening and how they break down. We have our master events. We have our dojo events. But new, Steve, what, what do we have as new? We have our dojo prime event that's coming up. Newly added to the Tekken World Tour roster as well as that master prime event, which is a very special case indeed. And we got to get more into that too. Oh, yeah. And Michael, did you want to say anything about all the events that are going to be coming up? Well, as you know, uh, I think in the previous seasons, we had 14 regions was the most. This time we have 16. Uh, people, like you said, Pakistan's gonna be extremely exciting to watch, I'm pretty sure. And uh, the Dojo Prime is another dojo that's uh, new for this year. Uh, certain events that we'll be announcing later on, uh, but TOs can apply it to, to uh, be a, a Dojo Prime as well. So we'll have more details as we go through the presentation. Yeah, again, you guys can check out everything on TekkenWorldTour.com in a few hours. But also, you guys can, of course, just be part of these events. I'm, I'm, I'm super excited. Well, look, we already talked about being a part of these events, and we already know we're here for Combo Break, and we're going to get to that later, too. But what else do we have now? I believe we have our first stop on the Tekken World Tour already lined up, if I'm not mistaken. Yeah, it's already lined up. You, where are we going? You want to tell everyone where we're going, Steve? 
Yo, if you guys plan on attending CEO, you better sign up for Tekken World Tour because that's where the first stop is. But of course, as you see, versus fighting, Rev Major, the mix-up, all back to the Tekken World Tour. And I'm going to tell you guys right now, June 10th, guys, make sure you guys get in there. That's the last day to register to make sure you get those points. So if you want to make sure your points are in there, head to the Tekken World Tour portal, that eSports site, and sign up to it. It's, it's going to be updated in a few hours, so don't forget. And for all you tournament organizers that want to get in on the dojo action, you guys can start applying and submitting your events starting mid-June. Again, make sure you guys visit the website in the eSports portal. That way you guys will have all the information. But again, again, thanks for supporting the locals, and say, thank you for supporting your local scenes. So if you see what's happening up here, this new category is actually going to change. I think it's going to be really, really cool. On top of that, the dojo system that was added in before we got hit with the pandemic did great things for the community. I believe we saw a lot of players rising up, a lot of different communities getting involved. It was amazing. Yeah, and again, I think this is all great. This is happening soon. I'm hyped for the top eight. But before we get to the top eight, Steve. Wait a minute. You, you know, Michael Murray, you've been up here. And we just announced the Tekken World Tour is coming back. But what about our fine competitors? What about these guys? They played their heart out. Why can't we? But what about them? What about now, Michael? What about right now, Michael? What about right now? Uh, pressure, pressure. Okay, wait, 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 wait. Before we ask him about that, we were going to just talk a little bit about the format again, the points breakdown, all the stuff that's going to be happening. But you guys know how this works. You guys are familiar with Tekken World Tour. We have. I guess, Michael, I'll let you talk about it. Let's, let's, let's go to the end. Let's go to the important things. Michael, what is going on here for the players today? All right. Well, well first, we're going to go through the breakdown, right? So first, you got the, you notice that Master Prime, obviously, that's EVO, you know, the most important event in uh, fighting game tournaments this year for everyone, I'm sure. Also, you'll notice we added a new category in the dojos. So, you know, it scales depending on uh, how many points you get depends on how many people are uh, in the dojo itself. We have a new 48 plus uh, category, so it scales more for each of the events uh, as they are, right? Uh, what else we got? And also, you'll see the format is kind of similar to previous years. Your top master placement and your top four dojo placements, including Prime, go towards your ranking for your leaderboard. And that'll determine who gets to go to the regional finals and then also to the global finals early next year. So it works much like it did before, where your, your highest master rank goes in, as well as your top four dojo placements as well. I can't hear you. So yeah, it, it, it essentially works a little bit similar to the way it's worked before. But make sure you guys head to techinesports.bne-ent.net if you would like to sign up. Get your points established now if you would like to sign up and be a part of the Tekken World Tour. All right, we're about to get started with our top eight. I hope you guys are excited. You guys can, of course, sign up for the different tournaments. We're supporting more than just Star.gg this year. We're also going to be supporting Challenge and Tonamel. So everybody, get ready with your tournaments. Get ready with your dojo events. I'm looking forward to seeing you guys throughout the rest of the year. We're going to have a lot of stops on here. And if you guys have actually participated in the Tekken World Tour before, you know we got a lot of stops. So if you guys plan on attending CEO, you plan on attending versus fighting, you're going to Philippines for Rev Major, make sure you sign up. Make sure you sign up properly and get these points so you can qualify. But CEO is going to be the first stop for the Tekken World Tour, and that Master Prime is going to be EVO this year. Oh, yeah. So once again, Michael Murray, what are you doing for us today, right now? Wait, wait, wait. We still got some details, right? We want to make sure that everyone signs up for CEO first. That's going to kick off the tour. Combo Breaker this weekend has just been insane. So I, I am so much looking forward to CEO. So sign up for that event. Be sure to sign up in, in Start or Challenge or Tournament, whichever one you're using. But also go to the ETP to make sure you sign up for the tour itself. So don't forget that or you'll lose that on the points. So that's a very important point. OK, I think that's all we got for the tour so far. Bro, what are you doing? Mike, Michael. Tell us, Michael. Michael. What are we waiting stop, for? Tell Michael, us. Michael, stop playing with me. Give the people what they want now. All right, thank you very much. Just Whoa, kidding. Bro. <laughs> so, obviously, uh, Combo Breaker has been so hyped this weekend. Uh -huh. It's always a very exciting stop on the uh -huh. tour. However, this year, unfortunately, it's not on uh, the Tekken World Tour. But just to show you all a little bit of love, uh, you know, we have the top eight coming up. I'm sure everyone wants to take home that first place trophy. 
Uh, just to motivate you a little bit more, Bandai Namco will be adding 5000 to the prize pot. $5,000 right here, right now. Yo, can you make some noise right now? $5,000 right now, that's for y'all. That's for the players. And, and the winner of Tekken 7 at Combo Breaker will get a flight and hotel for EVO. All paid up to play in EVO, a Master Prime event, if you can win Combo Breaker. Guys, first off, can we make some noise for Michael Mori coming up here, showing love. Can you make some noise for yourselves? Make some noise for yourselves. And last but not least, yo, Mark, man, thank you so much, man. Yo, make, make some noise for the boy, Mark, man, bro. You guys ready for the top eight? Y'all ready for that top eight? Make some noise! Let's go, good ass second! Let's go, let's go!